What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Leo, and you enjoy my content, you can ring the bell and follow my soul tribe. You can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying, just saying, saying. Um, this is week four's reading for November of 2021 for the sign of Leo. This can resonate if you have Leo in any aspects of your chart, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Thumb, and Hammer, Jupiter. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. I got one channeled in as I was meditating on your weekly energy. And the um, message I received was, a for some, a water sign and for, for some, for some, a fire sign is about to, uh, very angry, is about to try to attempt to come back into a Leo's life. Use your best discernment. So you plug it in, however that resonates, if that resonates for you, Leo. For some of you guys, it's a very angry water sign. And for some, it's an air sign. Okay, a lot of people. So for some, it's an air sign. For some, it could be two or more. You plug it in, how it resonates. For some, it's a water sign. For some, it's a fire sign. For some, it's an air sign. Water signs are Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag, air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, they're going to, I heard they're going to try to attempt to come back into your life. Uh, use your best discernment. So, you know, you can choose to have them in your life or not choose to have them in your life. But um, just be careful. Use your best discernment. Um, if you feel they wish you ill harm or ill will or they do not have your best interests in mind, um, I wouldn't suggest doing it. But, of course, everybody has free will and you are free to make that decision as you choose. Okay. Nine of Cups reversed, Seven of Pentacles reversed. A water sign is in very, very, very dangerous, very dangerous lines of losing their home right now. It will probably happen soon. They're mad at you, but they took advantage of you in the past. They blame you for this. Be wary of this water sign. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Oh my God, you guys. So, um... For some, you have a water sign, for some, a fire sign, for some, an air sign. Angry. They're angry. So basically, they're going to try to come back. So transmute the energy if you can. I would suggest transmuting the energy um, or not allowing them back into your life. Some, they might try to come back in through text, messenger, email, or phone, uh, or person. However, that resonates. But very angry energy for the beginning message. So I would transmute it or block energy with them. However, that plugs into your life. Um, if they come to your house acting a fool, I would suggest calling the police. Um, that's just me. But you plug it in how it resonates. But if this resonates for you, um, this other message is a, a very angry water sign I heard. I heard they're in very dangerous um, position of losing their home soon. They blame you for it, but I heard they used you in the past. So they did nothing but use and abuse you in the past. But... It's like they don't want to take responsibility because they used and abused you in the past, but they don't want to take responsibility for that, so they blame you. They used and abused you, but they blame you because they're losing their house now because they used and abused you, which is crazy, which is crazy. Um, I heard they're going to try to come back. They're going to try to come back. So, I mean, that's the second message I got about a water sign. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. They could be um, masculine or femme. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Um, they could have Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Fourth, and Midhaven, Jupiter. It can be masculine or Finn takes on heavy masculine energy. And if they're very angry, I'm sure they will be taking on masculine energy, whether it's a masculine or a Um, But it doesn't, I mean, my goodness, they were using and abusing you. So, I mean, I would separate my energy and move on too. I mean, my goodness, this is crazy. So, Seven of Pentacles reverse. I think this is them losing money. For some, um, they were doing something, they were gaining money off of you. Whatever it was, they were doing something illegal and criminal and shysty and behind the scenes that was gaining money off of you. Because they're losing Seven of Pentacles reversed. For some, it's a bet they lost. For some, it's a bet they lost. Okay, so for some of these water signs, it's a bet they lost, and it's regarding you. 
So they're gambling with other people, but they were betting regarding you. For some, it is some some way, illegal, shifty, behind the scenes way, they were making money off of you. If that resonates, if that resonates for you. So you plug it in however that resonates. A lot of angry people try um, attempting to come back soon here, Leo. Spirit messages you have for the um, Leo. Spirit messages you have for Leo. Someone's lies are about to catch up with them in a huge, huge, huge way. Someone's lies are about to catch up with them in a huge, huge, huge way. Uh, so you plug it in, how that resonates. Um, that could be you or somebody you're connected to, but somebody's lies are about to catch up with them in a huge way. Um, for some of you guys, I feel it is these people, angry people trying to come back. I feel that's why they're angry because their lies have uh, caught up with them. It's exactly what I feel for a lot of you guys in the collective, Leo Collective. And I'm serious about that. Um, because they're coming back angry for a reason. They're coming back angry for a reason. Um, they're mad at you for a reason. Probably because their lies have caught up with them. That's what I'm feeling. So, Princes of Wands upright, Five of Wands reversed. A significant fire sign and an Aquarius is about to be very significant in a Leo's life soon. In a very positive way. You will get along very, very well with these people. New energies to you. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates, if that resonates for you. Uh, so new people coming in. So old people, angry people want to come back new positive people coming in that's the energy i'm feeling in here leo and that's i mean that's good so it sounds like you have blocked person people place situation toxic people toxic um, places situations and you're moving forward in a positive way if this resonates for you which is the way it, it, it should go and that's the smart thing to do um, but you blocking the negative you're either block the negative people or you have put up boundaries with the negative people However, that resonates for you of the people of the past. However, that resonates. But however it resonates, it makes a man because you've either put up severe boundaries with them or you have blocked them out of your life energetically or completely or what have you. Um, but it makes them mad because they can't get what they want from you. But you've got new people coming in. For some of you guys, I heard it's an Aquarius. For some, it's a fire sign. For some, it's both. It can be a masculine or femme, Aquarius or fire sign. The fire sign's coming off as a femme energy, but it could be a masculine they, that takes on a lot of femme. Because, you know, everybody takes on masculine and energy. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Um, but I heard you're going to get along really, really well with them. Really well. Really, really, really well. Will be a wonderful dynamic. For some, you are moving soon. Okay. I heard um, you're gonna get, go, going to get along with them really, really, really well. Really well. And... Um, um some of you guys are moving soon so for some these these people could be new neighbors possibly heard fire sign and um aquarius so it could they could have aries leo or sag or aquarius and there's some moon rising venus or them and jupiter it could be the new neighbors for some of you guys because some of you guys i heard a specific message you're moving soon so for some it could these could be neighbors for some it could be new co-workers for some it could be new business associates for some new um new people you meet out in the public in some kind of venture or creative thing you're taking on or um new venture you're you're gonna partake in or it, they might meet them at the park um some somebody new it's somebody new in your life i heard you're gonna get along very well with them so they have lots of desire drive and motivation towards you leo and no conflict there because y'all get along very well so um if it's a co-working environment if that resonates with you that's going to be perfect for you guys because your energies and your personalities will mesh well together, it sounds like. If it's a neighbor situation, that will get along well. 
they won't be trying to sabotage you or um you know slash your tires or put rats in your air filters or what have you um it'll be very very copacetic in whatever situation this is and a particular single parent leo is about to really really transmute the energy in a very positive way For her, uh, herself, his self, and the children. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. And a particular single parent Leo, if this resonates with you, you're a single parent Leo, masculine or femme, because I heard herself and himself, um, is about to really, I heard, transmute the energy in a very positive way for the single parent Leo, for you, single parent Leo, and for your children. So... There might have been negativity in the past, or maybe you uh, were fighting with your children, or I mean, I don't think physically fighting, but maybe there was verbal arguments there, or maybe there was um, conflict there, or maybe people wasn't getting along, or maybe other people manipulated your children to cause the conflict in your home, however that resonates, because that can happen too. Um, but however that resonates, you're going to transmute it for the betterment of you and your children. You can masculine or feminine because I heard herself and himself. So you plug it in how it resonates. So this is you transmuting the energy. You having lots of desire, drive, and motivation and transmuting the energy for the betterment of you and your children and you and your children's relationships with no conflict there. And that's beautiful. That's beautiful energy, Leo. All right, let's do one more and then we'll get a tea lady. Spirit messages you have on Leo. The universe has beautiful big things in store for a particular Leo soon. Huge positive happenings happening for them soon. Oh my God. I heard uh, the universe has huge big positive things happening for a particular Leo soon. Huge positive big things happening for um, you soon if that resonates for you. So huge positive big things happening. So you keep transmuting the energy in a positive way between you and your children make sure your children's relationship and your relationship is copacetic if that resonates with you uh for some it's uh you moving soon and you having very positive relationships with um i think neighbors in the community for some it is uh, i think a new business partnership or a new um relationship or a co-working situation with the aquarius and the fire sign However, that resonates. Um, and it's you removing the negativity out of your life, which is going to piss these people off. But that's not your problem. That's their problem. So, you, yeah, you're moving in a good direction here. I heard huge positive happenings happening here. So, that's beautiful. You just keep doing the work, shadow work, healing work, and keep working on yourself. Absolutely. Two of Wands reverse, Ace of Cups upright. A particular new opportunity for Leo is about to really have someone really having feelings for you. They're, they're going to display their feelings for you a lot sooner than they had anticipated on doing so. Respect and admire you. Wow. Oh my God. This is looking so good, Leo. So you can be masculine or femme. You take it out. Resonates. But um, whoever this is for, you're going to have some new opportunity soon. And it's been all up in here in the cards and the messages. It's been all up in here. Huge, big happenings happening for Leo. New opportunity. Moving into new energy spaces. New. Some of you guys are moving. 
some of you guys new jobs, some new businesses. I mean, new, 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 new all across the board. So 10 completion of cycle moving into new newness, but it's positive newness if this resonates for you. You just have to make sure you transmute the energy properly to make it work for you. Um, but however this resonates though, um, you got, it sounds like you're going into this new opportunity. You're about to be offered a new opportunity. I feel for some it's business, for some it is um, employment. Um, for some, it could be in your new complex that you're moving, you're moving location. So for some, it could be in a neighborhood, for some it could be in an apartment complex, for some a condo, for some a duplex. But it's a new new space energetically. You're gonna meet somebody and they're gonna, it sounds like they're gonna fall a little head over heels for you. I heard they're gonna um, end up displaying their feelings for you a lot sooner than they had anticipated. Um, but it's in a positive way. You got Ace of Cups upright. Their emotions are overflowing for you uh, in a positive way. I feel for some, they might want to date you. Um, for some, you might be, become friends and they might display that they want to be more than friends. Um, something of that nature. But however that resonates, but that's what I'm feeling here. So they didn't take action in the past. They've been trying to strategically plan. Um, this hasn't happened yet. It sounds like it's about to happen soon, according to the message. Um, when you get into your new energetic space, if this resonates for you. But they were planning on two of wands reversing. Um, no action, taking no action, not telling you how they feel. But it sounds like a series of chain of events is going to occur coming up that um, they're going to reveal how they really feel about you in a very positive way a lot sooner than they had anticipated. So they were taking like air sign energy, trying to stop the wheel, trying to um, not tell you how they feel, trying to be strategic and um, in their planning with this. But it sounds like something's gonna happen to where they're gonna reveal their feelings a lot sooner than they anticipated. Is the energy I'm feeling here. But you plug it in, how would it resonate? Oh, that's the recycle people. So yeah, that's exactly um, what, but that's a good one. That's a good one. Uh, somebody is moving from severe toxicity to positivity in like serious, huge ways. Spirit messages you have for Leo. A particular Leo's neighbor is about to get a huge, huge, huge wake up call and reveal serious toxicity of the past of a Leo and their family. The Leo and their family was harmed in a huge way. Family, their family harmed them. And this neighbor knows this. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. So, um, a Leo's neighbor, if this resonates with you, um, Leo, your neighbor um, sounds like um, knows, I heard you that you and your family were severely harmed in the past. So, you and your family were harmed. I heard by your family, by your family. But the neighbor knows that your family harmed you, harmed you and your family. Uh, you you have children, if this resonates with you, Leo. You have children. So you and your kid or kids were harmed by your own family. But your neighbor knows this, and they've been keeping it in. But I heard basically, it sounds like at least one of your neighbors, it might be two or more for some of you guys, is going to reveal it soon. Um, and it's going to create many positive series of shame events for this Leo and their children. This neighbor sees the real truth now. Okay, I heard it's, and it's going to create many positive series of chain of events for this Leo and their children. The neighbor sees the real truth now. So it sounds like it's going to turn out positively for you, Leo, if this resonates for you. Um, that's wonderful. Um, your neighbor sees the real truth now. So they were lied to by your family or by somebody else, but your family severely harmed you. They just, uh, they did something terrible to you. They either stole from you or they put sugar in your gas tank or rats in your air filter or slash your tires or did something cray cray, cray on you um but the fan but your neighbor sees the real truth now and they're going to help you out in a huge way i heard whatever information they're going to reveal to whoever they're going to reveal it to 
is going to create many positive series of chain events for you and your kids. So that's beautiful. That's beautiful energy, whoever that's for. That's at least one person in the universe. We have ring. A marriage will take place either romantic or business. For some Leos, you will attend a wedding soon. For some, you are getting married soon. And for some, a false marriage is about to be exposed and it's going to benefit you in a huge way. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So for some of you guys, you're going to a wedding soon. So congrats to that. I love weddings. I love dressing up. I love dancing. I love eating good food. I love going to weddings. So congrats to whoever that's for. Uh, for some of you guys, you are getting married soon. So congrats to that. You go with your bad self, just saying. Um, and for some, you, it sounds like you're in a fraudulent marriage, but you obviously don't know you are because fraudulent marriages, you don't know you're in the marriage because you never put yourself there to begin with. Um, and somebody put you in there for money, but the fraudulent marriage is about to be exposed. For some, I feel it could be by your neighbor is what I'm feeling for some, but you plug it in how it resonates. Um, if that resonates, um, but I heard it's going to be, it's going to benefit you in a huge way. So the fraudulent marriage being exposed is going to benefit you in a huge way. And yeah, I would hope so because you never put yourself there to begin with. And obviously it was done just strictly for money because you don't even know you're in the marriage. So yeah, absolutely. So, um, so for some, you're going to a wedding for some, you're getting married for some, uh, fraudulent marriage is about to be exposed on you. So a marriage will take place either romantic or business. And a particular Leo is about to get a wonderful, some employment opportunity and some expanding their business. Some both. Okay, this is looking so good, Leo. My God. And for some of you guys, you're about to get a new employment opportunity. And for some, you're going to expand your business. And for some, it's both. So that could be the marriage taking place in the business aspect. If that resonates for you, that's beautiful. Caterpillar, things will always be this way. A change is coming. A change coupled with all this positivity and newness and beautifulness. Um, you, I mean, there's some negative messages in here. You've got a lot of negative, angry people trying to come back. Probably going to cause drama with you. But if you can transmute that or block them completely or just stay away from them, I think you'll be fine on that. You just keep focusing and growing and on growing you is what I'm, energy I'm feeling here. Um, things want to always be this way. A change is coming. This coupled with this coupled with the messages are beautiful. I just want to say. Huge positive changes coming. For many Leos. High vibrational Leos that really deserve it. Okay, I heard huge positive changes coming from many Leos. High vibrational Leos that really deserve it. So um, things won't always be this way. A change is coming. So positive change is coming for you if you deserve it, basically. If you put good into the universe, good will come back. You put negative in the universe, negative will come back. So um, you plug it in how it resonates. One particular Leo that sex traffics and human traffics is about to be exposed. Family member of another Leo. Oh my God. So you, you plug in how it resonates. So at least one of you guys has a, you Leo, you have a family member Leo. If this resonates for you, um, whatever family member Leo this is, it could be a mom, a dad, a brother, a sister, a, grandma, grandpa, whoever, but um, some kind of family member, Leo. They're Leo, you're Leo, but it's your family member, Leo, if this resonates with you. They human and sex traffic. I heard they're about to be exposed soon. So you, that's the change coming too. It sounds like it's going to, uh, it might mortify you for some. Some, you might be happy they're being exposed. I know if it was me, I'd be happy if um, they were exposed. I don't care if you're a family member or not, you should be doing that stuff. But some of you guys, you might be mortified. You might be mortified. 
that it's um, being exposed, but somebody's family member is about to be exposed. So you plug it in, how that resonates with the change of this family member about to be exposed for human trafficking and sex trafficking, um, however that resonates. Rico Law. Rico Law is what I just heard. Rico Law. Rico Law. We pulled that in like a month ago. That's all I heard was Rico Law. Hold on. Let me look it up real quick and then we'll close it. Rico Law. That's something to do with like, I can't remember. I'll have to look it up. Hold on. Racketeer Influenced and Corrupt Organizations Act, RICO, is a federal law designed to combat organized crime in the United States. It allows prosecution and civil penalties for racketeering activity performed as part of an ongoing criminal enterprise. So I heard RICO law. So maybe one of you guys, um, you're connected with somebody that's about to be indicted uh, for the RICO, with the RICO law, or you are helping indicting someone with the RICO law. Or you were a victim of someone, you were a victim of some, some kind of racketeering and organized crime activity, and these people are about to be locked up with the RICO, according to the RICO law. That's what I'm thinking, and that could be the changes coming as well for some. You plug it in, how if that resonates, if that resonates for you. Holy moly. All right. A particular Leo son is about to fall in love with the federal agent. Oh my God. Oh, wow. Wow. Holy crap, you guys. So you plug it in how it resonates. And it will definitely be the other way around. Okay. Well, okay. You got your bad self, Leo. So I heard uh, Leo's son. So you have son in your um, placements. So you are Leo's son. You have um, Leo in your son placement. Um, of course, check your bar chart. Bar chart, um, if you feel this might resonate with you. But I heard you're about to fall in love with a federal agent. And it's definitely going to be the other way around. So you plug it in how it congrats to you. So maybe y'all falling in love. Y'all will get married down the line, possibly. You plug it in how it resonates. All right, we're done. I love you guys so much. I feel guided to get one more for some reason. I feel guided to get animal spirit and then we'll close it. This is a good reading. Holy crap. Spirit messages you have from Leo. People, some people are about to move connected to a Leo. They're going to try to hide. But the law is about to catch up with them. Know this. Oh my God, this is so strong. Oh my God. I heard some people are going to try to move connect, uh, move soon connected to a Leo. So they have, <coughs> excuse me. For some, I think they've committed a crime against you. I've committed, I think they have committed the crime against you. Maybe they were involved in this, <coughs> excuse me, in this RICO crime. That's exactly what I think. In this RICO, uh, RICO crime. I think they um, <coughs> performed um, racketeering and organized crime against you. That's exactly what I think. Because I was trying to read it and make sure I had it right. I think they performed um, organized crime against you, but they're being exposed or about to be exposed. But I heard they're about to try to move soon to get away from it, to get away from the law. So to avoid the law, avoid um, 
being exposed and yazzy, yazzy, yazzy. But I heard the law is going to catch up to them whether they want to or not. Um, kind of like some bad boys energy. Bad boys, bad boys. What you going to do? What you going to do when they come for you? That's what I'm feeling. Uh, and we, okay, this is what I pulled in. I've never got this one. And wow, I love this one. This might be my favorite one. I've never got this one. Right, white raven spirit, trust in the magic. And it's beautiful. Number 66 could be very significant for someone. Number 66, it could be age of you or somebody you're connected to. It could be a possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible social security number, possible green card number, possible jersey number. Um, some kind of significant number in your life in some shape, form, or fashion, or reoccurring numbers you're seeing on advertisements or billboard, 66. Also, I, I just heard 666, so I'm going to look up 666 as well. That might be significant for someone. Angel number 666. <clears throat> a particular Sagittarius is getting a huge wake-up call. Okay, I heard uh, Sag is getting a huge wake-up call. They have Sag in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, and Venus, with Jupiter. Positive insight and a tremendous amount of power. Angel number 666. You know, most people think 666 is a bad satanic number, but there is an angel number 666 um, and. Seriously. And the angel number 666 is um, positive insight and tremendous amount of power. So I think you have gotten huge insight on these crazy people that were once in your life. And that's why you're blocking them or you have blocked them, however that resonates. And you're moving away. Um, and you're moving towards positive energy, which is going to bring you uh, power in your life. Give you control and power over your own life, which you should have. Everybody should have control and power of their own life, period. And I think you realize these people are trying to take away your control and your power of your own life. For some, you have children. For some, you don't. And that's your your intuition is heightened. And that's why you've either separated yourself or about to separate yourself. And that's why you're moving towards positive energy, which is about to <clears throat> expose some people, I think, for some RICO crime act, the RICO law, RICO crimes. That's exactly what I think for some of you guys. But you plug it in how it resonates. White Raven Spirit, Trust in the Magic. The universe is about to work this out in a huge way. Huge, positive happenings happening soon. For the ones that were victims. Okay, so you, true victims, not victim mentality. Okay, ooh, I just heard true victims, not victim mentality. And apparently that's specific in here. So you plug it in how it resonates. So true victims, not victim mentality. That was specific from spirit. So people that were true victims. So I think whoever this is for, you knew you were a victim in this. You were trying to get the hell out, but you were trying to be tactful and reasonable. But these people wouldn't let you go in some shape, form, or fashion. It's like come to me in my little clutches, my pretty. And they just wouldn't let you the hell go. They wouldn't let it go. They wouldn't let it go. They wouldn't let it go. Well, now their ass is about to get exposed because they were so selfish. And you were trying to do the right thing, but they wouldn't allow you to do the right thing because they were benefiting off of you so badly. Um, but now the energy is about to shift in your favor. If this resonates for you, that true victim mentality that you were gang stalked, bullied, harassed, braided, um, maybe hidden camera energy, how that resonates. Um, I feel a lot of you guys, it has to do with that the RICO Act. They were performing organized crime against you, including racketeering. Um, for some, you could be the evil, low vibrational Leo that performed the racketeering or um, organized crime. How that resonates. But um, I heard huge energy shifts about to shift for the actual true victim, not the ones playing victim mentality. So somebody was playing victim mentality up in this biatch, but somebody's getting a huge wake-up call and realizing the real truth. Definitely realizing the real truth. About to amend it in a huge way. Oh, my goodness. I heard definitely realizing the real truth, about to amend it in a huge way. So, um, yeah, somebody, I think it might be a federal agent for some of you guys. 
I'm serious, is about to amend it in a huge way. That's wonderful. That's wonderful. So trust in the magic. Trust if you were the true victim, trust that it's going to come for you soon. The balance is going to be restored. Positivity is going to come your way. You will finally get out of this crazy mess or um, balance will be restored and you will have health and wealth and all the beautiful things in your life that you deserve, basically. Um, for the ones that played victim mentality, the ones that played victim mentality, they are about to get it in a huge way. Negatively. Negatively. Okay, I heard ones that played victim mentality in the past, they're about to get it in a huge way. Victim mentality. Um, yeah, so they played victim mentality in the past. Oh, poor me. Oh, poor me. Oh, poor me. But in reality, it wasn't them. It was somebody else. But somebody's picking this up. So uh, trust in the magic. Trust in the fact that it's about to really, really the scales are really about to be balanced for you. Um, true Leo, true Leo that really deserves it. Uh, I feel there's another Leo that was trying to steal somebody shine, is what I feel, or lied on another Leo. How that resonates. All right, you guys, we're done. I hope this helped. I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices and I'm going to stay.